What's up guys, Maxima here, back with another short video on Curse of Arrows. Hope everyone is doing well today. It is a beautiful day in Calhoun, Georgia. And today we are going to be killing some baby dragons. So, nothing special, nothing to write home about, but I just finished crafting my umbral helmet. I just finished crafting my dormant shield. So now I'm kind of wanting just to kind of relax and kind of farm some dragon claws, some dragon horns, and some scales. I only need two more pieces to complete um, my full set of Umbra. And it is the plate body and the legs. So we are getting there. I actually am really close to having the pieces to make the plate body. I just need to buy the dragon eye. And I'm not too far off from that. So, um, I've actually had a tremendous amount of luck at the baby dragons ever since Varaxis update came out. Every time I come down here, I get claws and horns. Well, I just say, I'm really hoping I get a claw or a horn drop during this video. I actually was making this video earlier at work when another employee came outside and I felt awkward like talking into my phone like I was talking to other people with them sitting there staring at me so I cut the video off and not 15 seconds after I cut the video off I got a horn so I always like it when I get a very rare drop during one of my videos I think that's the coolest thing ever um, so I have been fortunate the past two days in the last 30 hours I have actually gotten two spectral helmets and a phantom helmet no I could not believe it I got the two spectral helmets literally five kills apart from each other and then I got the phantom helmet like 12 hours later and just so you guys know it was actually the first helmet that I have the first spectr uh, phantom helmet I'm sorry that I've gotten since I've played this game and I've played this game since it came out in 2019 or uh, did it come out in 2018 I really don't know um, I started playing really early on there was no Varaxis or anything like that when I first started but um, I have only actually killed the ice demon like a hundred and thirty times the whole time I have played this game so I've gotten four spectral helmets and a phantom helmet and like 130 kills, so that's pretty good. I absolutely love this game. As I said in some of my earlier videos, I just recently started back about four days ago. I had uh, quit playing around Halloween last year. I just got bored, I guess. Um, I work a lot of hours, um, a lot of days, but I was really searching for that next best mobile game and I was like what about Curse of Arrows like so I came back and I'm absolutely head over heels in love with it all over again I think Curse of Arrows is is like one of the best mobile games ever I mean it's got everything I want I'm 33 years old so I've been gaming for a while um, I like old school type games and Curse of Arrows really gives me that feel uh, it's really simple and straightforward. It's like, hey, level up and you get this gear, you know. Go kill these monsters and they may or may not drop this gear, you know. And I do lo I do like the drop rate. I like it because not a lot of people have it in them to sit and kill something over and over and over uh, to get the item. Not everybody wants to get to level 90 to wear the best gear. So it gives you a chance to really be unique and to kind of separate yourself from everybody else. Not saying that if you don't get to level 90, you're not a good player because you could be like level 22 and have 100 mining and 100 crafting or something, and that's very impressive. Yeah, I'm definitely glad that I'm back. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna finish getting the rest of this uh, Umbra armor, and then I'm gonna go for max level. So I'm totally and fully prepared to do that. Dragon scales. All right, come on, Claw. I'm telling you, I do. I have a tremendous amount of luck here. If I was to come down here and grind for like five hours straight, 
I promise you, I would leave with like four claws and like two horns. I promise you I would. Like I have really, really good luck down here at these baby dragons. I really feel a claw coming on. I really do. I, I feel a claw coming on pretty strong. So let's see if we can't make that happen. I can only record 15 minutes on my phone. So if it doesn't drop within 15 minutes, then I just can't. I won't be able to get on this video, but I will get one on one of my videos for sure. So yeah, I don't farm the Umbra boss much, mainly because I do not like sitting up there and taking turns gang banging the Umbra boss. And then like you, you wait your turn like 20 minutes and then somebody either jumps ahead of you or they try to jump in while you're fighting it and that just pisses me off and I'm like fuck it. So I just grind it out and get enough to buy it because the Dragon Eye has dropped significantly since last time I played. When I quit playing last year, the Dragon Eye was like 280 mil, 300 mil. It's like 125 mil now. So, I mean, technically, you can sit down here and farm like, let's see, what would it be? Like six or seven claws and sell them for a Dragon Eye. And it, and it honestly wouldn't take that long to farm six or seven claws. Like, we're talking like two or three days. You know, if you really put in the work. So, that's what I've been doing. I have just been kind of farming uh, rares. Oh, there it is. Look at that. Dragon horn. Okay. Okay, dragon horn drop. I told you I felt a rare drop coming on. I did say claw, but I'll take the horn. <laughs> Let's see if we can get a back-to-back -back drop. Come on. Right here. Here comes the claw. <laughs> see, I told you I have really, really good luck when it comes to farming these dragons. Like, really, really good luck. I've only been in here seven minutes, and I've already got a, a horn job. And that, that very could have well been a claw. So, we got seven minutes to go on the video. I really feel like that's enough time to get another horn or a claw. We'll see. Come on, come on, come on. Dragon scales, we will take the dragon scales. So yeah, a lot has changed in this game over the past couple of years. I really like where the developer's going with it. I'm really excited about, every time there's an update, I'm really excited about the new content and like what it's gonna bring to the game. So, I'm thinking, once I get the full Umbra, obviously I want to go for max combat. But, I've really been feeling this tug deep down that's saying, Hey man, like, we could cut wood, we can mine, we could fish, we could do all kind of stuff. Like, you know, max one of those skills out. So, I don't know, I'm really torn, to be honest, between max level, max combat level, and maxing out, getting level 100, and probably like wood cutting or mining. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so we're at 8 minutes and 40 seconds. We have one rare drop, which was the horn. We have been able to, uh, okay, still active, you know, get some dragon scales and stuff like that. Of course, we need those. Um, but I do, once I get two claws, I'm going to go buy the dragon eye. And then I will most definitely, um, Go ahead and make my umbra plate body and then i'll come back down here and farm the scales and the um the horns and claws again and then just buy another dragon eye and i'll have the full set of umbra ah uh, come on nine minutes and 25 seconds in can we get a second rare drop and I'm almost confident that we can. And it just goes to show you, if you'll just come down here and go hard on these baby dragons, or, or any monster for that matter, you're going to eventually get your drops. You just got to cluster them up, kill as many as you can, as fast as you can, and just keep doing it. Don't stop. 
I mean, you got just as good a chance on each kill to get it as the next man does. That's the way I see it. All right, we're at 10 minutes. Come on. Let me get a claw right here. I, I always feel like the claw is coming. And then it usually comes later. But not too much later. Come on, guys. I know I'm beating y'all's ass, but you got to spawn faster for me, okay? Okay, come on. Here goes the claw. Ah, I got a ring of might. Nobody wants a ring of might. Okay, we're at 10 minutes and 50 seconds. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, two dragon scale drops back to back. Not bad. Can definitely use. I got almost 500 dragon scales, so I'm pretty sure that's enough to make the uh, play body. I already have the horns, so. More dragon scales, more dragon scales. Come on. Come on, Jesus Christ. That was tough. All right, 11 minutes, 30 seconds. Give me the claw. Come on. Come on. Okay, 12 minutes. Got three minutes left in this video. And I've only gotten one dragon horn. I've gotten several scales, a ring of might, and some spades, whatever. But I'll take the dragon horn, that's fine. I'm almost certain that the dragon horn has the same drop rate as the um, claw does. I'm really not sure. So I don't know why there's such a separation in price. Maybe I think it's because items needed to craft. Maybe the claw is more sought after than the horn is. Okay, we are nearing the end of the video. It doesn't appear that I'm going to get a claw, but you never really know. So <coughs> We are going to finish grinding it on out. Two minutes left. Come on. Come on. Come on. Watch, like, as soon as the video's over, I'll wind up getting one. But still, even still, I mean, 15 minutes. Oh. 15 minutes, dragon horn, several claws. Not, not bad. I'll take it. I'll take it. Jesus Christ, die. Just die already, Jesus. Dragon Claw. Miss, 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 miss. You know, that absolutely blows my mind. I mean, I got accuracy relics, accuracy scrolls, umbra sword. I mean, I just missed like four times in a row. Come on, Dragon Claw. No. Alright guys, so we are ending the near of the video. It was really good making this video. When I get home from work, I like to just sit down and play some Curse of Arrows and just make a video and hopefully get some rare drops in the video. And we were able to get a horn. I feel like if it was a claw, that would have been much more impressive. But oh well. Didn't get it. And that's okay. So I'm going to go up here and kill this last little swarm. And we're going to end this video before it just runs out and cuts me off so anyway guys it was good making the video i hope you guys liked my video 
subscribe to my channel for more videos i do videos on several different mobile games and i hope everyone has a good day this is maxima over and out